Jerry Rice, I'm not here to compare Steve Young and Joe Montana <laughs> to Tim Tebow and Mark Sanchez. I understand that. Okay, all right. All right I, don't, I don't want to lose all credibility with you. However, I want you to take us back to those San Francisco days. Explain to us in the locker room what the dynamic was between those two players, obviously the guy who started and the guy who really wants to start, and how did it spread to the rest of the team? How did it affect the rest of the team? Well, it was a little bit difficult at first, but these guys, they wanted to win. And with Joe Montana and Steve Young, they put the team first. I think with Tim Tebow, um, I was a little surprised he decided to come here to the Jets. And the reason why is because of the Wildcat. And I don't think that's over long term. I don't think that's really going to help his development as a quarterback. And, you know, with T Tebow, you got the Tebow mania. You got uh, Tim Sanity, mm -hmm. all of that going on. And if these guys can coexist in the locker room, um, you know, hopefully they can win football games. But you don't think it'll affect the rest of the team? I don't think it's going to affect the rest of the team because they know what they're dealing with right now. And also Rex Ryan uh, stated that he wanted to give him around 20 plays in the Wildcat. And I, I really think Mark Sanchez, he has something to say about that <laughs> because he wants to be on that football field. Right. And if he doesn't play well, then all of a sudden Tebow is on that field and the fans might start chanting, Tebow, Tebow. Twenty sounds like a lot. Or uh, that's a lot of that's, that's that's really a lot of plays. Right. And maybe not maybe not all Wildcat. Maybe he'll be a third tight end. Maybe in a running situation or a decoy, I suppose. But twenty is a lot of plays. Yeah, it's a lot of plays. But I think they want to try to get everything they can out of Tim Tebow, and he's here to help this team. So he uh, he needs to be on the football field. And Mark won't be nervous at all. Uh, maybe a little bit. He's going to be looking over his shoulder just so. a little. And he knows if he doesn't play well uh, and if uh, Tim Tebow does, uh, it could be a quarterback controversy in New York.